All right, 637 on your Tuesday morning in just a few hours, if not already, 4th of July firework stands are opening up all over town. You know, they're run by nonprofits and of one kind or another or organizations raising money. Mary Jane Bellier is live with more on the firework stands and how one particular nonprofit is helping folks in need of a place to live. Good morning, Mary Jane. Hey, good morning to you, Sherry and Nate. Well, we are talking about the Freedom House here, and that fundraiser for the Freedom House kicks off this week, and they're making a big push as many local nonprofits and organizations open firework stands around the valley today. The Freedom House is a local nonprofit providing housing, mental health, substance abuse, and treatment services for people experiencing homelessness. The Freedom House hopes to raise between seven and nine thousand dollars, which will provide two and a half years of housing and support services for up to 14 people. Freedom House CEO. Jeff Iverson says all the money will go towards their scholarship fund. This is probably like the last house on the block for them. And, you know, it's interesting. A lot of people may feel like, well, they kind of got themselves into that situation. Get, you know, they should be able to figure it out. But the bottom line is if somebody's not there to help them with a hand up, not necessarily a hand out, like we want to be able to provide a path for them. Now you can purchase fireworks from the Freedom House in the Albertsons parking lot on the corner of Rainbow and Warm Springs. And this is all part of the city's safe and uh, safe and safe fireworks campaign, which is the only type of consumer fireworks that you can purchase legally out here in the city and other local cities within the Clark County area. And again, everything is on sale starting now. And these fireworks really help our local nonprofits and organizations, including the one where we're at on Rainbow and Spring Mountain that's benefiting the Las Vegas basketball gamers. So go out there, support your local nonprofits and organizations, all while having fun and safe this 4th of July. Reporting live, Mary Jane Bellioso, Live Local Now.